UFC 4 will officially release on the 14th. So I might as well share my experience of the trial. The trial period. As we are creating Rakim Tyson. We do have a time limit, folks. We have a time limit. So I didn't really business about, you know, what I look like once ufc 4 officially releases y'all we about to get things going we are about to get things going at this build we created rakim tyson in the middleweight i, I end up changing my mind i was like oh i can't make my player my fighter excuse me <laughs> to 611 like the actual head of rakim tyson so we decided to just lower down the weight just a little bit and him to middleweight man i don't got much time to waste i'm excited if you are excited for this series let's get 20 likes let's get to the story mode you two ready for the interview yeah all right actually before we begin and this is off the record no uh -oh. <laughs> i just hear there's an interesting story about how you two started working together <laughs> Yo, he wants to hear about your first fight. <laughs> hey, here's a good one. He hates when I tell a story, but oh man, I will never forget the first time I saw this kid. He was getting busted up. He looked like a zombie. It was one of those less safe amateur cards you can find across town from time to time. Great fights, never know if you're gonna see something special. Right, so yeah, this kid caught my eye because his eye was all busted up and bruised. But it was a total mismatch. It was obvious that the opponent was way more experienced. This kid took a beating for two rounds. Okay, probably both 10 8s. They could have stopped the fight easy. But the bell sounds to start the third round. And this kid is still coming forward. He's still fighting as if he thought that maybe he had a chance. There was no chance. <laughs> Oh, so we're starting things off. But my player got whooped. Okay, let's see what I can do. Oh! I don't know how to play the game, how to block. Okay. All right, there we go. Just got to survive the round. Oh, get it beat. Oh my goodness. I'm getting whipped. <laughs> I don't know how to play this game. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yo, my player don't got hands at all. His. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. Oh. There we go. That was a nice kick. How do you get out of the clinch? Now nah, I'm getting whooped. Stop, I told you I'm getting whooped. <laughs> oh my god, I'm getting whooped. <laughs> oh my god. This is not right. This is not right. I gotta definitely learn how to play this game. Because I am trash. See, I don't know how to pl really play this game as much because I haven't played UFC in a minute. Jeez. <laughs> oh, I'm on the ground. Yeah, I got to definitely learn how to really play this game, man. At least I'm surviving. You know I got rocked so many times. So 
nothing I can do because I don't have a ground game. I have no type of game. Just gotta survive the round. Just gotta survive. Just gotta survive. The last three seconds. <sighs> I gotta admit, I got whooped in this <laughs> this match. I have a lot of work to do. No surprise. Kid loses the fight. Bang. This isn't one of those stories where you find someone amazing out in the middle of nowhere just knocking people out. No. I just found a kid with heart like I'd never seen. So I reached out. Good, good. Five more seconds. Let's go. Work. Work. Three, two, one. And time. Beautiful. <laughs> hey, look who it is. Hey, welcome to my gym. The champions are made. I can tell from that last fight, you got tons of heart, so I'm not surprised to see you back at it so soon. And you got great physical ability, too. Thanks. Now we just got to work on that technique a little bit. <laughs> All right? Okay. Some people think that fighting is simple. Like checkers, but you and I, we know better, right? It's more like chess. You have to have all the right pieces and know how to use them. All right, the masters make it simple, but it takes hard work and an open mind. I've seen you fight, so I know you got what it takes. Go get ready, come back and meet me here. All right. All right, welcome. Thank you. All right, let's go. Back at it. Get it. Yeah, good. I know this seems pretty basic. You already know this, but I always like to start with boxing fundamentals, right? Because in this game, if you don't know how to throw them hands, put together some combinations, and manage your stamina, you're going to end up hitting nothing but air and sucking wind. That's true. So, listen to my voice. I'm going to call out some instructions. You follow. Good? Good. Let's go. All right, we're about to do some punching bag work. Here we go. So I'm just working on that. Yo, I'm so bad. Oh, I was about to say, I was like, yo, this man keeps missing the hooks. All right, so square just uppercuts. Yeah, I was I was literally punching air. <laughs> Okay, body hooks. Body uppercuts, okay. Not bad. I gotta I gotta definitely work on like my techniques. All right, it is some combos. So square. Yeah, I gotta definitely learn these controls because since I'm sent just like my first UFC game, gotta learn the combo so I can. Now let's see how that technique holds up against a live sparring partner. Now here, the name of the game is hit and don't get hit, right? Sweet science. Easy to say, hard to do. So, hands up, use your feet. Let's go. Let's go. All right, let's put this to the test. Block. Come on, throw a post I can block. All right. <laughs> Yo! Nah, the way he just. Yo, Todd, bro! Come on, go, go, go. Oh, he's not even moving, that's why. I see. This is like a counter punch, leaning hook. Next 
Just tap, boom, tap, boom. Okay. Oh, damn! Yo! Mm. <laughs> this man starts punching out of nowhere! Nice Giving him some mean combos. Working on what I've been working on in that punching bag. So I'm getting used to the controls. I gotta oh! <laughs> Yo, he got rocked. Oh damn. Yeah. Oh 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 forget it, forget it. Oh weave. 